tiga action. What is up guys? Fahan here with Za once again and today we are back with Fami. Yo, what's up guys? At Famoto Yo. and yeah, the main man himself. <laughs> so today we're gonna talk about air filter. I think personally, uh, I never really care about air filter one. Uh-huh. I usually overlook uh-huh. what the heck is air, what, what does an air filter do and all that. This has always been in my mind uh, for quite some time. What is the purpose of an air filter actually? Okay, the purpose of the air filter is actually one of the most important component of the engine. Its job or its duty is to filter out any dirty air or dusty air so that your engine will always have a clean air mm-hmm. for the combustion. Okay, so this is why it's important for, to have an air filter on your bike or use an aftermarket air filter, all this. But of course, the main purpose of the air filter is to just filter the air. Lah. You know, like your aircon got the filter, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, ah, so yeah. it's to make sure there's no dust get into the, the system, all this. So it's the same thing also. Yeah. So I'm just curious, where does the, the air actually direct to? In a motorcycle, right, there's mm-hmm. air fuel ratio. So for this air fuel ratio, right, there's a certain calculation uh, that the ECU will make so that your engine will have the proper amount of fuel plus air to have a combustion uh, for your engine. Uh. So when there's a fuel vapor spray, the air must push the fuel vapor into your block so you can have a proper combustion. So that's the purpose of the, uh, the air for the air filter itself. Yeah, so when you start your engine, there will be a vacuum. So it will suck your the air, you know your air box, there's a hose right? From through the hose, it go into your air filter, when you, the, once the air is already filtered out, then the clean air will go through your throttle body and through your engine. Yeah. Wow. Mm. You know Azza, <laughs> you know my old bike Hidayah right? I never change I never change the air filter ever since I bought the bike. You know? <laughs> For seven years. Wow. For wow. seven years. Carburetor <laughs> different. Carburetor air filter is different. Oh really? Ah. Yeah? Uh. How's different? It's just same lah. Okay, because my one base part is a metal air filter, you know. <laughs> yeah, let's see lah. So Zas one is a reusable air filter lah. Yeah, reusable air filter lah. So basically, air filter is typically you must clean the air filter every ten thousand kilometers or yearly. Mm. But of course, you can actually check your owner's manual to actually properly see when you must change or clean mm-hmm. your air filter. Mm-hmm. But out there in the market, right, there's brands like KNN, Spring Filter. There's a lot of brands. Ah. Okay. I only know KNN only. <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of brands ah, that you can reuse. Okay, you can actually clean the air filter, mm-hmm. spray the air filter oil, and then you can actually reuse back the air filter itself. Mm. Uh, how often mm-hmm. do we replace the air filter? And uh, how do we check the air filter for its condition? Okay, so sometimes inside your bike, there's a owner's manual. Uh, some don't have, uh, okay, but you can actually Google the owner's manual also. But if let's say you are unsure, you can actually follow this rule of thumb. It's either every 10,000 kilometers or every yearly. So how do we check the air filter's condition when it, when it is due to change? For you to check the condition of your air filter, right? you can actually do it yourself. All you need to do is number one, to locate where is the air box uh, of your bike located at. Okay? So some bikes, they are located at below the seat. Okay, but some bikes also is under the tank. So under the tank are usually those class 2 bigger bikes. Usually you need to remove the tanks and you can see the uh, air filter is under the tank. So it's much more work for you to do if you want to check the condition of the air filter. you <laughs> Okay? But of course, uh, if let's say it's just under your seat, it's actually very simple. All you need to have is just your handy screwdriver. So I just gonna open. Okay? But of course remember all this is the proper tool lah, when you want to check your airbox or this. So for me, I have a question. Lah. You can see the dust on the airbox. Uh-huh. Why okay, is it so, so dusty? Sometimes, ah? right, this area, right, you are not supposed to spray water on it. Okay, you cannot spray water on it because first of all, the air filter cannot get wet. Okay. Secondly, there's a lot of fuse boxes. Sometimes got fuse box. Sometimes you see got camera wires. All this you want to avoid water. But what you can do if you want to clean this area is take a wet tissue, wipe out the whole thing. Uh, it's good enough really because nobody want to open your bike. See, is it spotless or not? Nobody lah. But other than that, is the dust an issue for uh, the uh, air filter box? Dust is not an issue if you have an air filter in it because the job of the air filter is to remove the dust. So when the air goes in, the dust all will get filtered and only the clean air will go through. Yeah, so that's the job. So again, so what you can do once we open up the false screw, wow, you see, son? Yeah, it's, it's due to change. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
So uh, you see, uh, the condition quite bad lah. Uh, some, but it, some, sometimes it's okay lah. But sometimes you need to have like at least uh, allowance lah in between the air filter. Cannot get like cannot get it squished too much. Okay. So this one honestly must change lah. Uh, uh, <laughs> must change lah. Uh, <laughs> I mean, okay. it's it is due because my I I practice uh, annual, uh, annual changing. Yeah. Mm. yeah. That's that's so, good practice lah. Okay. Just this is around maybe around thirty forty dollars. Just throw the money and just get a new one lah. Or you want to get the aftermarket one can go up to hundreds of dollars also, which is a usable one. But it was a good investment. Some of my customer that I came across lah. Not say it's wrong, it's nothing is wrong, it's your bike anyways. But what I can advise is that you will actually lose your top speed. You can have the pickup but you can you actually lose your top speed. Mm. Okay, and you will have problems when debris start to go in your engine block. Uh. That's where your cylinder head can get spoiled, your block can get spoiled because you've got debris go in. So all this at least have an open port air filter or a air filter to or a thinner air filter lah if you want to have a more performance but it's already been proven from other videos ah. An air filter doesn't increase horsepower, <laughs> but only make the bike sounds nice only. That's all. Okay, it's been proven ah. Got people really go put aftermarket air filter all this. They go dyno, but then uh, there's there's no increase in horsepower lah. <laughs> ah, so of course, like this, you see the color. A new one will very, will be a very bright red. But this one you see like black black all these. Uh, this one. Just change, ah. Mm. Just change. Okay, because your bike also need oxygen. Like your body, you want clean oxygen, right? You want to put air purifier on your house, all this, right? So same. Give your bike a fresh, clean air for it to breathe in. Okay, so change your air filter regularly. Every one year, like, at least. Okay, so for me, just now mm. we spoke about uh, your reusable air filter eh, and uh -huh. also aftermarket air filter. Uh -huh. uh, you know, sometimes, like some, some people say, stock air filter is already good enough. Mm -hmm. or some people want to upgrade to a reusable one or mm -hmm. even like this what you have here, a stainless steel, steel one. Mm -hmm. eh. So, and even a reusable one. So, which one is actually better? A reusable one or actually a disposable one? Put it, put it, just putting it simply. Lah. Sure. So, basically, this is just uh, my own uh, preference. Lah. If I will want to change an air filter, I will usually go for the aftermarket brands. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes, right, okay, this one is not for this bike, lah, but this is an example. Sometimes, right, the original one, the airflow will be much more smaller. And for sometimes, aftermarket one, you can see it fully utilize the whole thing. You can go with reusable uh, air filter with aftermarket brands. There's a lot of brands. Canon is one of them, uh, but usually Canon they only have for big bikes, uh, bigger bikes. Ah, yes. uh, they don't have for small bikes. So oh, weird bikes like this, uh. Nah, you got, you got for small bike, uh, wing wing, uh, you know, uh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but of course uh, you can actually. Google lah, Google or go shopping, get uh, aftermarket air filter all this. Then for yourself, what what uh, models or brands you carry for air filter um, here? Infa Moto. Infa Moto, we carry Canon, we carry Rapido, we also carry original uh, air filter. So depends on what the customer want, we can actually cater to them and order for them also if they want a specific brand. What if I were to leave? The air filter unchanged, you know, like in Farhan's case, ah, seven years he never changed the air filter, <laughs> or, or just I just just leave it, you know. That one for Farhan case, you take the air filter, you go and throw at him. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody will want to do that, lah. <laughs> Nobody will want to leave the air filter unchanged, ah. But of course, if anyway you forgot about your air filter for seven years, okay, your bike still can perform. But it won't, it won't perform at its optimum performance. I just use an aircon as an example. Ah, aircon, ah. Okay, when you clean your air filter, right, you have a very cold air, right? But what happened? Seven years you don't service your aircon. You don't clean the air filter. Mm -hmm. Of course, the performance of the aircon will be much more lesser. There will, there will be no cold air. There will be blowing hot air, all this. Mm -hmm. Because the filter is already clogged up. Then because there's not enough air flowing through the, your engine, then your performance also will decrease. Mm. Like that. Yeah. Not say your bike will spoil. It might spoil, but it's always best to practice to change your air filter every one year. Well, Fami, thank you so much for you know sharing with us the importance of maintaining a clean air filter. Yeah, <laughs> Sorry, Hidaya. I mean, I stole her away. <laughs> the seven years never changed. I don't know the new owner, or maybe she scrapped already. Yeah. <laughs> Will affect the air filter or not? But then, yeah, I hope that with Melina, 
Maybe I will change your episode soon lah. Uh. More, more pampering her lah. I'll be more pampering Evelina lah. Yeah, because I really totally forgot. I only know oil filter only. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's what most of our customer, you know, think, you know. Or uh, come service, uh, oil filter, oil filter, oil filter. But I, just, I will ask them, when's the last time you changed your air filter? Um, <laughs> I'm not sure lah. <laughs> uh. uh, that's why you sometimes must open up and check the air filter for them mm. also lah. Mm. 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 Yeah. Okay lah. So yeah, um, that's it for the vlog. Any riders want to review the bike? Ask to get us with us on our social media pages below. Yeah, like and share this video. <laughs> like and share this video with your riding kakis and don't forget to subscribe. If you see us on the road, just say hi. Thank you to Farm Moto. You know, Thank you so much, for guys. Thank you, guys. Teaching us the importance of our air filter lah. Once again, you can always come here to service your bike, overhaul your bike. You know what else? Uh, we do from accident claim to towing to. Servicing of your bike, to overhauling of your bike, every all in one lah, all in one move lah. We do everything lah. Right. Yeah. Everything. You want to spray your bike also? We can settle for you. <laughs> Hi guys, thank you for staying till the end of the video. To all the viewers out there, Tamba Overlanders and Farm Moto would like to give you guys a special promo code. Just code Tamba15 to enjoy 15% discount off your total bill cap at $20. Enjoy! I <laughs> see, they have everything, you know. Yeah. yeah, that's it for the vlog. We will see you in the next one. Give me all of your life.